Hello friends. From this video tutorial, we are going to make social networking site in PHP by using Ajax jQuery with MySQL database. In some previous video tutorial, we have already made complete login registration system in PHP by using PHP script with OTP method. So, we have used that tutorial, source code for this social network website login and registration module, and by using that code, we have make social network website in PHP. Here we can see home page after login into system, and here user can see their initial avatar, with welcome message. For change profile details, user has to click on this profile link, and here user can see their profile details. Now suppose user want to edit profile details, and change their initial avatar. So, for change profile details, here we can see edit button, so we have click on edit button, and after click on edit button, here we can new web page has been load. And here user can see there, profile details in form format, so here we have change profile details. After fill profile details, now user want to change their initial avatar image, so we have select profile image from local computer. Now we have click on update button, after click on update button, here page has been redirect to view profile details page, and here we can see complete user profile details. And here we can also see, user profile image has been changed. So this all things we will discuss, in next 3 video tutorial part. In addition, we will add new feature on every publish of video tutorial. There are many viewer has requested us to again publish video tutorial of follow unfollow system. So based on that request, we have again make social networking website in PHP, with MySQL database, and this is first part of this tutorial series, and in this part, we will see how user can manage their profile. Now let's start discussing this part, this is user register table, in this table, we have store registered user data, but for make social networking site. In this table, we have add some new table column like user birth date, user address, user city, user state and user country details. This all details, user can fill by editing their profile details. Now we have go to code editor, and here we can see our working folder, and here we have use complete source code of PHP login registration system using OTP method. First here we have open header.php file, which is new file, and in this file, first we have write session start function. This function will start session variable under this page. After this, we want to see this content to only login user. For this here we have write, if statement, and under condition, we have write, not operator, with isSet function. Under this function, 
we have write session user ID variable. If this variable value is not set, that means user is not login into system and try to access this page. Then it will execute if block of code and under this block, we have write header function with location set to login.php. So when user has not login into system, then it will redirect to login.php file. Next, we want to make database connection. So here we have write include statement and under this, we have write database connection.php file. This code will make database connection. Below this, we have write include statement and under this we have write function dot php function so by this statement we can call the method of this function dot php file in this header dot php file we have already included jquery library bootstrap library and date picker library link here we can see the bootstrap library code for make responsive navigation bar. In this navigation bar, we want to make our system homepage link. So here we have write anchor tag with class is equal to navigation bar brand and ref is equal to home.php and in anchor text, we have write webs lesson. So it will make home page link in navigation bar. After this, we want to make profile and logout page link. So here under an order tag, we have make to list tag. In first list tag, we have write anchor tag with ref is equal to profile.php question mark action is equal to view and between this we want to display user profile image so here we have write get user avatar function with two parameter like dollar session user id variable and dollar connect variable with profile text here we have already make get user avatar function under function.php file and this code will display user profile image under this navigation bar after this we want to make logout link so here we have write anchor tag with ref is equal to logout.php and in anchor text we have write logout so it will make logout link under this navigation menu bar next we have go to home.php file and here we have removed this part of code and here we have write include statement with header.php so this code it will takes the all the content of header.php and copies into this home.php file now we have checked this output in browser. Here, we have already login into system. Now we have refresh web page. After refresh of page, here we can see navigation bar has display above welcome message. And in navigation bar, we can see home page link, user profile link with profile image. Currently it has display initial avatar image. By click on this profile link, user can view profile data and they can also edit their profile details also. And lastly we can see logout link. By click on this link, 
user can log out from this social networking system. So in this part, we have make navigation bar for this social networking system. And in this next part, we will display how to display user profile data on web page.